Lonnie is here with another taste of spring around here, Lon. It's going to get warmer outside, but look, this time of the year you expect the temperatures to go up and down, and they're going to go up and down over the next five days. Right now, when you look outside, believe it or not, the temperatures are going up. I mean, we're 47. All day long, we were basically like right around 44 to 46 degrees. We bumped things up like around 7 p.m. 47, we actually made it up to 48 at 1030 at night. 31 was the morning low. So again, the bulk of the day, up until about 6 p.m., you were 46. So with a high of 46 and a low of 31, I mean, during the daylight hours, I, you're basically exactly where you should be for March the 1st. The averages are 45 and 32. Well, you know what, speaking of averages for this March the 1st, let's talk about the month as we look ahead. Because here we go. If you think we're done with snow, an average March, nothing crazy, just your basic average March gives us five inches of snow. We pick up four and a quarter inches of rain. Now, the sunset is something else because today, the first day of March, the sun set at 547. By the last day of March, it sets at 719 at night. Remember, the middle of the month, March 13th, you spring forward with the clock, so that helps with that sunset time. But that's something to look forward to. I know, Mo, you hate losing the hour of sleep, but, you know, sun, sun, sunlight later in the day is pretty cool. 52 will be the high temp tomorrow. That's a good-looking day. In fact, I'm calling it the pick of the week. Now, if we take a look at my list of what's going to happen after we go through tomorrow's 52 and nice outside, well, we got a little moderate clipper system that's going to drop in early Thursday morning. There is some precipitation with that. I'll show you that in just a bit. But the temperature's going to be dropping. After it passes through by Friday, your temperatures don't get out of the 30s. Then the weekend comes along, and there's a rain chance this weekend, but it's not a washout. Uh, let's go through everything here. So you're going to start off with what it looks like outside right now. And we do have some rain showers out there, light showers. Anything here that's either the light green, that real pale green, not even making it w its way down to the ground. And the darker green is it's nothing more than a light shower. But we've got some like around, you know, Rye, New York, Greenwich, Connecticut, into the, the, the Fairfield coast. And then you've got a little batch here around the, the border of Putnam County and Dutchess County. A, a little bit in orange, a little bit in Rockland. And there's not too much out there. There's a little more that trails off to our west, but I really Really don't think there's going to be a big deal for your night. This is the area that we're watching for tomorrow. This air mass right here will give you a temperature of about 52 degrees. Good looking sky overhead. Wednesday is the pick of the week. Behind it, we've got this a chance for some snow showers well north of the area by the time you get to Thursday morning. Everybody else would probably pick up a raindrop. So, how much snow? I mean, it may be well north. You see a trace to an inch in some spots. All right. That's all we're talking about. So, let's get right to it. Here is your extended forecast. We are 52 for Wednesday, 42. Thursday. Again, Thursday morning, that clipper system comes through. Really cold on Friday, 23, only up to 39. Saturday and Sunday, both days come with a rain chance. Nothing major, 45 Saturday, 59 Sunday. Monday, 67 with a rain chance. And I want to talk about this right here. First alert weather. Now, no doubt you have may have maybe noticed that on the screen. We are presenting our weather a little differently these days, giving you a special warning about specific days of the week. We'll shade an entire day in red to really give you an alert for what's going to happen out there to be ready for possibly some severe weather. The CBS2 weather team is going to take you through our first alert forecasting promise. We have a special show coming up. It's called First Alert Weather Predict and Prepare. It's this Thursday at 5 30. It's right here, <laughs> obviously, on CBS2, but we are going to explain first alert weather. I I encourage you guys to, to tune in for that because the weather's getting more and more intense. You know it. We want to get the word out to you when it happens. Okay, Lonnie, we'll be there. Thank okay, you. Sure will.